Sometimes I might say I was cool, but every night you let me up, learn my lesson. With you by my side, I don't really care what the neighbors might think. Cause I'll be alright, as long as I'm living with you. I came with the hard times, but you brought the good times. You make my life brighter, brighter. I found my way, you're only gonna love me. You're never gonna judge me. Now I'm coming higher, higher, every day. The goalies have taken the warm-up. The teams have come from their dressing rooms. The popcorn has been sold. There's nothing more to do than start this game in the EA Sports Hockey League. Skates it into the zone. Pitching it to Kong. Nice tip of the pass. Couldn't get his way through. Pitching this one to Kong. Got it at the point. Side to side they go, trying to generate something. Shoots one. Has that pass off the boards to the half wall. Rockets one. Great save. Skill play by Yoshi. Fires. Point blank save. Great display of goaltending right there, Doc. Oh, my, what a hit. Goldski's arrived at the rink in a bad mood. That didn't take him very long to get physically involved in a game that should be aggressive throughout. 
Golski's hooked on this play, and the arm of the referee is high. The 67s are activating their power play unit for the first time. So their first power play gives them a chance to get one on the board here. Pass attempt to Kersling. Hammers his way up the wing at center. That attack shot right down. Skilled play by Bishop. Buffalo's in their own end and controlling play now. Got it back out of the zone. Directing that one to Kong. And that one's chopped away. World-class deep there. Scorches one. He wore that puck on a hard shot. Painful block shot there. Recollected. And the penalty killers come up big again. It's cleared. Gocha Duke's heading out of the defensive zone. The 67s needed something from their power play and didn't get it. Moving it to D'Agostini. Well, they didn't get much done there, and that was a key opportunity for them. They had trouble getting the puck to the net. It seemed like when they shot it, they didn't have enough people getting to the net at the right time. He corrals it again. Buffalo's carrying it in their own end. Taken up near the boards by Bishop. Has it in his own end. Loose puck, the defense got in the way there. Gathered up again by Yoshi. Buffalo skating from the neutral zone. Nice work by D'Agostini. Pulled it right back. Worked into the corner by D'Agostini. That puck hit him on the way to the net. Stopped icing. A little over seven minutes remaining in the first. Still nothing on the score sheet yet. Nice face-off work. The 67s lug that along in their own end. It's dumped in. He knocked it on. And the puck exits the zone, breaking up the play. Got it in his own end. There is Isaac. Puck dropped, and the winger stepped in to help. That's big. Stole that pass. Puck's loose, denied by the roadblock. Score! They've got the draw. Looking for Yoshi. Using the point, he's got it. A point blast! May not have intended it, but it hit him. Let's a shot go. Didn't miss by much. There's not really much place to go with the shot. He's trying to be perfect. He misses, and the puck rings around the boards. Looking for options up the wing. Brings it in for an attack. The 67s have it along the side at mid-ice. That's an offside. Ottawa's got another face-off win. The clock has bled down to the last minute. Curse legs tripped up. That should be a penalty. A shot. Whistle is blown. And a man with guilt all over his face is going to the box. Ottawa's sent to the box for two minutes. It's tripping. They took that draw and won it. Let's it go. Blocked. Couldn't get through. It's loose. First period has been played. An interesting start to all of this. Continuation in just a moment.
Buffalo's connected once, and that's the only goal. play goes back to work here as the period begins. What a heavy hit. Oh, he's been looking for that hit all night. He cleared that puck out of there. Trying to go to Cappy. Enormous collision. Oh, he got jolted there. He wasn't expecting to get hit like that. Nicely received at the point. Intercepted that one at an important place. And he's hit again, and hard. He's got a target on his back. Collected by D'Agostini. The 67s have killed off the penalty, and so we're back at full strength. Buffalo's been assessed a minor penalty. Two minutes, and the call is tripping. The 67s power play gets another chance to operate. Hasn't been effective yet. No matter how often you work on the power play, the ones that struggle go back to the same basic tenants, and it's to simplify things. Get it to the point, shoot it, get traffic, retrieve it, shoot it again. Trying to get rid of that puck. Not all the way. Huge hit. Possession's gone. Two immovable objects against another one. The boards. Steps in from the neutral zone. Terrific determination by D'Agostini. They worked hard and they got it back out. Good job of penalty killing here by the Buffalo. Now it's directed to Kong. Ottawa's power play could have made a big difference, but did not. This can really be frustrating for the coaches and the players on the bench when your power play doesn't find a way to come through for you. You have a chance to tie the game and you just can't get it done. Flip to the opposite corner. Good grab again. Terrific determination by Bishop. The 67 shifting gears back in their own end. Slid to Cappy. Oh, and the pass just didn't work. Ottawa's goal. He'll pay for that. Hey, guys, he's trapped on the ice. He can't get off. He's hurt, but he's going to have to try and finish this shift somehow. Ottawa setting things up in their own end. He's got that pass and can look ahead. Passing one off now to Cappy. Many yards gained to Kersling. Puck is thrown to Yoshi. Chip to Kong. Fantastic poke check by Bishop. Gathered up by D'Agostini. Scooped up by Yoshi. He was standing in the lane and got some of A hit that can make you mad. I like that he's trying to create space by throwing the body round. This is a way to change momentum in a hockey game. Snapping a pass to Bishop. Has that one measured at center. Buffalo's in possession as they travel in their own end. Grabs that pass in the offensive zone. Steps across that line. Not on the net. Instead, it's one. A big collision there. Oh, an error on that pass. Good chance here. Pass to the slot. Lightning-like reflexes there. Great glove save. And a hold and a whistle. Now, this shift had to seem like an extra minute for him. He was banged up earlier on it. Still gets out to block the shot. Good job on the draw. Lots on that to Cappy. Pitching it to Yoshi. In with it now. He pulled it right back. Smart recovery by Sadine. Odd man rush two on one. Lost the puck, just couldn't get by. 
Shutout positioning by Sedin. Laid on to Paris. Wonderful stop. Pitching this one to Bishop. Pass attempt to Cappy. Not a free puck now. Can start the attack going in the zone. The 67s are looking to make a play out of their own zone. Ottawa's in their own end, hoping to make a play to center. Bodied off. Terrific poke check. Grab that pass in the neutral zone. Nice play with the stick. Nothing more will come. That puck is loose up. Good defensive play. Two periods are in the books here. And the books could very well have some perspiration stains on it by now because these teams have worked pretty hard. But still, a third period is ahead. On to the shots on goal at the end of two periods. Five for Ottawa and three for Buffalo. Buffalo's netminder has fashioned a goose egg on the opposition side of the scoreboard at the end of this period. We are still thinking about the last huge save, which was this one, right back after this. minutes have been played they are getting ready for the third period here so take us back through the game what do you think Eddie the 67 stock trail going into this third period they have to start converting some of those chances that they've had the time of possession has been in their favor but they're still down is able to move on in and now we get the stoppage of play in the penalty call Ottawa's given a minor here for tripping Buffalo's power play gets another chance to operate Hasn't been effective yet. They've been on the power play before. It's not been very effective, but they get another one handed to them here. Fantastic poke check. Took that away in his own zone. Ottawa's gotten it back out. They check the clock, get ready to defend. Directing that one to Kerslake. Moving it to Sedin. Looking to Cappy. The pass fails and the puck leaves the zone. Somebody over early offside. Neutral zone face off one. Possession established here. Ottawa's cleared. A lot of work, but penalty time less and less now. Trying to go to Cappy. Now it's directed to Kersley. A howitzer. Score! Outstanding job on the power play. And they've won the neutral zone faceoff. You win that, and you don't have to chase. They chase you. And he dumps it in. And the pickup. Passing one off now to Yoshi. Shot. Oh, Outstanding man. save. What magic to even get the shot away. The shooter thought he had a chance, but the goaltender robs him. What a stop. On to Sedin. Cappy's been caught with the physical play again. Gathered up again by Yoshi. Outstanding body contact. Even when the puck's on your stick, you better know where everybody is on the ice. Curse Lake's trying to work his way to center ice. Set up with a drop to Sedin. Propelled to Curse Lake. Very important steal for him. Whistle blown for an offside. Over seven minutes have gone by. Two goals have been scored, both by one team. They've won the faceoff. Back in his defensive end to get it. Puck is thrown to Kong. 
Takes it in from the neutral zone. And make a play from the corner. Ottawa's in possession as they travel in the defensive zone. Wonderful play by the defense. Slid to Sedin. Picks it up in his own end. Strong play there by Bishop. Great job on a cut pass. Let's it go. Great save. Snapping a pass to Yoshi. That puck is loose. No luck getting through that time. It's dumped in. Things are heating up with that hit. That puck's loose, mishandled. The roadblock helped. Oh, he put it in his own net. It counts against him. What an embarrassing play. I don't know what he's thinking. What on this green earth is he thinking? Shot the puck in his own net. Go have a seat. Buffalo's goal has taken them to an even larger lead on a night that they have had the offense going. Third period of play. That puck's loose, defended away by Sedin. Buffalo's played so well defensively tonight. Their goaltender has been excellent. And while some people think it's bad luck to mention a shutout, well, they're trying to protect one. And I'm not going to affect it sitting in the middle of a video game. Gathered up again by Bishop. Banked right ahead. Buffalo's hoarding the puck at mid-ice. What a tremendous hit. Sometimes when you're frustrated, you just want to take it out on whoever's closest to you. He put the steamroller on this guy. That is a big hit on a night that has been pretty brutal for his team. Somebody crept in offside. And that's a face-off win. The 67s are at the wing in neutral ice. Cut that pass in his own end. Now, a little bit of a sloppy turnover, Doc, but that looks like a guy just trying to make too much happen. He wants to get his team back in the game. Shoots. Pad save. Puck collected. With 53 left. That move not too slick there. Pitching it to Kerslake. Tripped up on the play, and there will be a penalty. Well, we are late in this contest, but when you see him, you call him, and that's what they've done here. They won that battle in the dots. No completion on that pass, thanks to the stick. Crosses that line. Passes to the slot. Oh, what a stop. Incredible hand-eye. That puck is in the glove. Solid work there by Bishop. Great job by the defenders to kill more time. The 67's ready in attack back in the defensive zone. Takes that pass up the boards. D'Agostini's got to shovel it out of there. Just like shootout. Save. Might have saved the game there. So an evening with anticipation ends in disappointment, but out of defeat can come the seeds of victory next time. Playing your position is a big part of being successful in this league, and unfortunately, the players will need to work on that a little more. So the teams have left the ice and are getting rested for next time. For this time, for Eddie and Ray, Mike Emmerich saying good night.
Chillin' for, I won't need it more, yeah. Honestly, I'm not just anybody. I know I go hard as anybody. Say my goodbyes and hellos, cause all them bros leave home. I just been around the world, ain't nobody else. That could do it like us with nobody help. When the chips about to fall and I back against the wall.